JFK to 911. January 17, 2020 by Anna Von Reitz. Not America, the U.S. When you are talking about the American industrialists working as transnationalist corporations, then you need to think about the idiots serving them. The politicians and the militarists? I watched this whole movie and the major part of the error is that it was not and is not America to blame. The major part of the problem, then and now, is that the U.S. is not America. The U.S. is a vicious collusion between the United States Municipal Government and the Territorial United States of America as put forth by the Declaration of Interdependence of the Governments in the United States, 1937. And they both belong to the Pope, because the municipal government is his responsibility directly, and the United States of America, Inc., is his indirectly via the Queen as overseer. All this is bogus BS to the extent that it tries to blame America for the sins of the U.S., and it is beyond high time that we all recognized the fact that these two things, America and the U.S., are not synonymous. And what the U.S. has done in our name is not our doing, either. As we crank down to the end of this movie, what we hear again and again is that America has done this and that these people, the criminals, are Americans, but in fact all these bad actors are not Americans. They are all 1. British Territorial United States citizens or 2. Citizens of the United States municipal citizens instead, and they have nothing to do with America or Americans. That is, as useful as this film is for certain purposes, it is still missing the point, that these bad actors are not Americans now and never were. They are simply criminals engaged in criminal activity and they have nothing else to justify who or what they are. If you enjoy having Anna's latest articles made into videos, please consider making a purchase from Ed's website wellnessrods.com, thank you.